We live in a three-dimensional world, up, down, left, right, forward, backward. At the level of the fundamental laws of physics, there's no special direction in space. And how you perceive that is, imagine you're an astronaut, you're flying around in your little spacesuit. there wouldn't be any difference between any direction you could look. There's no experiment you could do in physics that would point out a direction in the universe, but space still exists. Likewise, time would still exist even if there wasn't an arrow. But here on Earth, we do have an arrow of space. If I pick up a coffee cup and let it go, it will always fall down. There's clearly a distinction between up and down. No one is tempted to think that the arrow of space, at least no one in this century, is tempted to think that that's a fundamental feature of the universe. We all know why things fall down. It's not because downness is embedded in the laws of physics. It's because we live in the vicinity of an influential object, the Earth. And we can even imagine it wasn't there. We can put ourselves in an alternative universe where we're floating in outer space. Here on the ground, there's an arrow of space, but it's clearly because of the Earth, not because of the fundamental nature of reality.